Oh, friends, are we ready to use our ears to listen and hear? Yes, today we are going to try to discover sounds, sounds that we can make with nature. Can you guess? What is that? Two pieces of wood. They are sticks. Yeah. It makes a nice sound. Oh, I like it. Let's try to guess by listening and hearing what makes this sound. What did you guess? Look, it's good too, but they are like log slices. The sounds changed a little bit, right? Yeah, I guess so. And it still sounds really good. Can you guess what makes this sound? What was your guessing? Big pebbles, rocks. Do they sound like they would? Do they sound different? I guess so. They have a very different sound. I'm making the same rhythm, but the sound is different. All right, ready to guess again? Listen. Can you tell what makes that sound? They are pebbles too, but they are smaller. So the, the sound changes too. When the pebbles are smaller, the sound is louder, it's higher, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, what else do I have here? Let's guess. Do you want to listen again? <gasps> they are seashells, very tiny seashells. Can you see them? Yeah, and they make this sound. I think they sound different if you compare them with the wood, but not so different if you compare them with the Rocks and pebbles, right? Hmm, interesting. Can you guess this sound? What is that? It's a rainbow. And this was handmade, but inside and outside too, it has something that came from nature. Can you guess what is inside the rain stick? They are teeny tiny pieces of seashells. Yeah! That's why they make a similar sound. I mean, it really sounds like the rain, doesn't it? Let's try to make like light rain. And a heavy storm. <laughs> Do you think 
<laughs> it sounds like a heavy storm. I'm not so sure about it. But I do like this sound. Oh, so nice and relaxing. Hmm, what else can we try? Okay, let's see if you can guess what makes this sound. What is your guess? Can you believe that I was making sounds with these very dry leaves? They fell off the trees in the fall, long, long ago. And I kept them inside. And now they are kind of hard. They are still very fragile. But when I wrap them together, they make that sound. So interesting, huh? Yeah. I have something else that I wonder if it's going to make sounds. Did you hear something? Do you know what I, what I did? Ah, I got two feathers. Yes, I found them outside because in this area there are a lot of crops. And they fly, they fly everywhere around. And always there is a feather or two that fell. Yeah. And they make sounds if you wrap them together. But it's a very soft sound. Thank you for exploring sounds with me today. I had a lot of fun. Now it's your turn to go to the backyard or to the playground, to your front yard, even if it's small, you might be able to find some nature and try to discover the sounds they make. Next time, you can let me know all about it. Okay? Great! Thank you for making sounds with me today. See you next time.